Hey, it's me, your girl T. Tut here with another weekly skin tip. And today, skin tip, we're going to talk about freckles versus sunspots. Okay, so freckles are typically genetic and some uh, fade with age. And they're usually, uh, you get freckles kind of young, okay? That's how you know they're freckles. Um, if you have freckles, you're probably sensitive to the ultraviolet light. Um, freckles are not a sign of uh, sun damage. A lot of people think that that is not true. They are not. Uh, both freckles and sunspots are benign. They're harmless. Um, some some spots <laughs> are normally um, in areas of the skin that have been exposed to the sun and also found in middle-aged people. So uh, a younger person is not really going to have uh, age spots or sun spots. Um, they're larger than a freckle and both people with sunspots and freckles should use what? SPF. Um, and if you're doing any outdoor activity like swimming, um, or anything where you're sweating and you're wiping a lot, you would need to reapply your SPF every two hours. But, um, I'm telling you the sun's rays are very very harmful and everything all skin issues could be helped if we just use the basics do the basics which is basically you know cleaning your face every day moisturizing and also using spf it, even when you go out your moisturizer or your your uh foundation it something you need to have spf on your face you have to on your your body you need to have anything that's going to be exposed to the sun you need to have fps so freckles you usually are born with you get what get them you know they develop a little more as you get older but you're not going to develop freckles in your old old age you may develop sunspots or age spots but not freckles okay so for any of your skincare needs, go to my website, queentuckcosmetics.com. Check out what I have. And thank you for tuning in to my YouTube channel. Could you please like, subscribe, and share? This has been another weekly skin tip with your girl, T-Tut. And I want you to have an amazing day.